Nobody's digging deep enough to see the real story. All they see is an angry, rebellious girl. Well, it happens hundreds of thousands of times a year. Our children exploited for sex and sold around the world. Tonight, there's a new call to save more of them from being forced into that life. And we're going in-depth with a look at the child sex laws here in the United States and the one missing in our state. They become very abusive physically, mentally, and emotionally. Carolyn Jones is able to talk about it now, but don't let that fool you. She's had a rough life. And a lot of times, girls want to hear nice things. They want to hear that they're pretty. They want to hear that they're somebody's princess. Carolyn is now 49 years old and tells me she was forced to work the streets of Phoenix as a prostitute starting when she was just 15. And if she wants out, then he'll tell her, if you get out and if you don't do this, I'll go to your school and kill your little sister. The average age of a trafficked child is just 13. A life where pimps, sex, and drugs is often all they know. I thought slavery was dead. I thought Lincoln freed the slaves. And I think most of us thought that. And it's not true. It's huge business around the world. Actress Mira Sorvino is an advocate for tougher laws against child sex trafficking. She spoke with us earlier this month while lobbying state lawmakers. Only six states have some form of the safe harbor law right now, which I think is one of the number one trafficking fighting tools that we have. Safe harbor laws take different forms. Arizona doesn't have one, but in other states where the law does exist, the focus is getting child prostitutes off the streets while trying to avoid prosecuting them for their crimes. I mean, they're Americans. They're supposed to have this, this opportunity to fulfill their, their possibility, and it's, it's just stripped from them in a very early age. As for Carolyn, she uses her experience to help other victims and works with Streetlight Phoenix, a safe house right here in the valley. So here's what one of the rooms look like. We have allowed so many things to just go uncovered and go unknown and swept up under the carpet and swept up under the rug. This is one I'm willing to die for. She hopes her message will lead to fewer victims. 100,000 children are sexually exploited each year, and two are sold every minute, meaning since this story started, four children have been sold for sex. In all, Arizona has seven different laws aimed at fighting human trafficking. We want to